So what do you do with all your shit? Recycling. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I think I just stepped in something. Okay. Hi everyone, welcome back to the Amazon. We're here with Sergio at Gota Lab. We're gonna be learning more about pee and poo and how to recycle it. We direct all the excrement and the urine and the waste from the toilet to these uh, biodigester tanks they're called. And now they're available in big hardware shops. So you can just buy it straight from the shelf, install it direct all your shit there and then um, the heavy excrement goes to the bottom of the tank and the liquid the urine is mixed with water and then it flows through this channel to this pond we have here then we cover the the pond with leaves or extra stuff to prevent the mosquitoes to live there the roots of the banana trees act as a filter for this gray water the banana tree is actually a filter so this water gives nutrients to the plants and produces a lot of bananas but the pathogens never get to the top of the hanging fruit. So then you complete the cycle. After two years, around two years, we open a valve in this tank and the solid waste comes out to a box next to it where we wait, it's already half decomposed being on the tank. And after three months, you can actually touch it. It's free of pathogens. You finish the decomposition process in this three months and you can use this as fertilizer for your crops. Wow. So it's void of any sort of chemicals? Totally. No because chemicals. It's been sitting. Yeah, there is actually, inside here, it creates a whole set of organisms that live there, decomposing your bacteria. You can actually buy a kit of these organisms. It's a life box, or like a little can, where you throw these organisms to accelerate the process. So cool. Yeah. So, why aren't we implementing this process like everywhere? I think uh, Westerns, we have this, this uh, it has a name, it's called Ficalophobia. What? Where we are scared <laughs> of our shit. So we're not taking responsibility about it and we just throw it to the ocean. It's yeah. like trash. Yeah, yeah. We just throw it and we don't know where it goes. <laughs> In urban areas it's harder, but, you, but uh, we have uh, sewage treatment plants. In developing countries, most of the time it, we don't have and it goes straight to the ocean. Yeah. But these systems could be implemented at a massive scale. This system here is ideal for a rural environment like this. No? If we implement it in every rural environment, we can have a positive impact. But the idea will be rethinking how we treat our, our waste and ideally giving it back to the soil. Because right. we've replace this uh, nutrients with chemical fertilizer. Be responsible of your crap. Everything <laughs> of your actual crap and your stuff we throw and your plastic bags and so true. Everything. So true. Yeah. We need to be responsible for the full life cycle That's cycle it. of how we live on this totally earth. So thank you for showing me your shit and how to recycle it. It's uh, definitely a system we need to start thinking about. Thanks for your interest. Most people don't want to see their shit. <laughs> <laughs>